What's up everybody? Today, not doing so well. Reason, uh, the reason why, because today we lost Desmond Amofa, better known as Etika. For those who didn't know, Etika's been missing for quite some time. Then later police confirmed that he did commit suicide. Which it was completely sad to hear. Now knowing that this affects me well because I myself have suffered from mental health. Whereas Etika suffered from mental health too. And he couldn't get the best help he needed. Which it was sad to hear. Now this affected me greatly. Because he was like one of those YouTubers I looked up to. Back, back around my Smash 4 days, I would like to... I would see his reaction, see uh, his gameplay, his, you know, it wasn't just about Smash, it was also about, um, it was also about Nintendo stuff. If it wasn't for him, I'm not into Nintendo like that. I wasn't into Nintendo, I wasn't into Smash Bros. or any other sort of stuff. He was the one person that made me love Smash Bros. <sighs> now, it's sad to hear that he can't experience anything. He can't experience Fire Emblem Three Houses. He can't experience Banjo-Kazooie and Smash. He can't experience... Uh, Or he can't experience new fighter, new fighters in Smash, or any other this other stuff that is coming around that Etika would be interested in, especially the Breath of the Wild sequel. And I was just shook by it ever, ever since I heard the uh, news that he died. I was shook, and I was shocked. When I saw his final video, it was a little sad knowing that the world will be better off without him, but I was a little sad. I'm sorry, y'all. I was just, I'm just still sad to hear, cause I found, cause I found out this afternoon, this afternoon, like a few, a couple hours ago, I just found this out, and I didn't want to make this video, but I just want to say something out that, um, that knowing that I care for Etika, and I also care about mental health too, cause since I was the one who suffered. Desmond you will be missed Christine if you're watching this I'm sorry for your loss and I'll be giving all my condolences to you and for everyone else who is suffering from mental health or mental health or suicidal thoughts please talk to someone I'll leave a link in the description to the National Suicide national suicide hotline so I can get people to help to get themselves the help you needed you need so all I want to say Desmond will be missed and I'll see y'all sometime